Hello people and welcome to this feature demonstration of my current work. Um, this is, as mentioned, a uh, combined first and third person uh, blueprint. Um, so let's take a look at what we had. Um, we have a normal uh, move controller. He can run with uh, holding one key down, sh um, shift or whatever. And uh, we can also go into first person and kind of make this movement as well. And we can take a look at down ourselves and see our movement and uh, without the head blocking our view. Oops, and that's another feature. We have some damage uh, effect going on. Also, we have uh, the ability here to, um, this is, for example, a box that you can kick around but we can also press interact and that's going to allow us to pick up the box and we can drop it again and that also works for something like this and one thing you will notice is that if I look in the general direction I don't have to look exactly at it but just in general direction we are able to pick stuff up and that uh, same uh, logic holds for for example if I want to open a door we can stand right here. We have to not interact with the door, but if I look a little bit more to the right, I can open the door. I can move through it. I cannot open the door if I'm turning the wrong way, but if I look at it, I can close it again. Um, so we also have a weapon here we can pick up. So that's actually going to allow us to have a weapon both holstered and uh, one on uh, uh, um, equipped. So another feature we have is uh, aiming, and we also have aiming in first person with uh, using uh, use of fabric nodes to uh, keep the hand on the on the gun, um, and we can also shoot stuff. So uh, let's shoot up something, and you will notice that we are going to leave a solid decal here on on whatever. We have. And we also have We also have um, this board up here that we can shoot to pieces. So in, the, in the tutorial, how this is done, shoot it all up so it's going to fall down. Okay, so let's put that away. Um, so all this works in uh, both first and third person. So. Uh, we have the aiming also in first and we can actually zoom a little bit. I don't have the iron sight yet, but it's something that may come. Um, so let's put away the gun. Um, so what else can we do? Um, we can... Uh, we have different animations actually. Uh, let's take a look at that. So if I jump, he's going to make this animation while running and if he's, he's uh, standing still he's going to make a different animation so that's also something that's demonstrated in this you can see the arms are swaying and it's different kind of and uh, also if we have a gun equipped um, he's going to have a third type of animation when jumping also uh, of course this um, works in first person um, so one other thing uh, which looks pretty cool I think is that if we uh, come up to something like this one and want to jump through this one we can in running mode jump through this one and uh, it works the other way around this of course and in first person that will look something like this and the other way around like this I have a slow motion key, so if I press this one, we can see it in slow motion. Uh, this looks pretty cool. Okay. So, and we also can uh, run up to this one and then slide under it. So, from third person, that's going to look like this. It's going to get stuck into the ground eventually, sometimes. sometimes. Um, let's try that again. There we go. Uh, 
Um, and then in the what I call the acrobatics um, section, we have the ability to walk up to something and uh, if we're close enough, we can jump up onto this and do some ledge climbing. And we can also cross a corner and we can um, climb up. Or if uh, we hang here and want to drop down again, we can do that as well. And this also works if we have something like a cylinder, we can you can see the trace going on here. It will keep the character facing that cylinder, and um, it works for different angles as well. So far, it's a bit buggy still, but it's um, it's a work in progress, and we have mentioned that somewhere. Um, so that is the ledge climbing part. Also, I have a little check for if I, uh, for example, if I um, jump like this, nothing special is going on. And if I uh, just walk out from this um, box here, nothing special is go gonna happen. But if I run and jump, it's gonna make this rolling fall, uh, which is also pretty cool. And it also looks uh, quite nice when you are in first person gonna make that tumble in the air. Um, let's try that from up here. Whee! All right, so um, the last thing I wanna show here is the um, most recent addition to this project, is that you can come up to a wall and you can press uh, duck, then you will be able to sneak and you can sneak the other way around and he's going to stay in that so you can kind of turn back and forth and um, you will also be able to go into first person that's going to allow him to sneak and peek around the corner because he will have further this um, um, you can see he cannot look so much back but he can look a little bit uh, further the other way around and uh, we can at our self walking here so it's going to allow him to peek around the corner slightly like this and if we don't have any uh, control or whatever we want to implement here we can cross whoops uh, we can uh, maybe cross the corner he's kind of bugged I, I see um, okay uh, sometimes it works. Let's try it again. Okay. Well, it does work sometimes. It looks a bit unnatural, and apparently sometimes it it bugs out. But yeah, it's um, something something I'm working on still. So. Um. I don't think I have anything else I want to mention. Um, nope. Oh, yeah. One last thing is you can, if you can't, um, if you can't reach, uh, for example, if you stand here and you can't reach that ledge, but if you make a run for it, then uh, you can jump up to that ledge and then you can uh, yeah get up, get up there anyway so for example this ledge up here uh, if you jump at the wrong time you can't reach it but uh, if you wall run it you can get up there kick away that med kit we don't need that and then jump out of this and make a rolling fall this is pretty cool um, anyway, it's a uh, work in progress as uh, mentioned, um, but I uh, hope this looks interesting and uh, as mentioned this is uh, something that I have a, a number of episodes uh, where I cover all the bits and pieces uh, to make this project um, yourself. So uh, I hope you enjoyed, bye bye.